La 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 Adam's little vlog. Tally ho everybody, this is AEB Games, I'm speaking, I'm here to play, not, well, not actually play anything, I'm here to test out this thing called Plot Generator. Now actually my little sister showed this to me, and I'm going to try it out, because from what I've seen, it's quite hilarious, and I think you'll agree. We've come to this screen first up, and I think the first thing to do is, the first thing on the list, entire short story. Now what it should come up to, assuming my internet is pacey enough, here we go. So now we've got all this stuff to fill out. Now I'm going to fill out all this stuff. For instance, the title will be name after the object from the story. And there's all this sort of stuff here like two adjectives that could be used to describe that place, four emotions. And I'm going to fill that in and give you a little hint of what I'm going for along the way. So the scene will be launch into action set the scene or focus on relationship. I think set the scene. The conflict shall be... Ooh, oh, oh. Uh, let's go for violent. And the resolution is happy. Because I'm a very happy person. Right, the protagonist shall be my car. Nedded. Last name. The Nissan. The secondary character is... Queen Elizabeth. God save our gracious Queen, long live our noble Queen. God save our Queen. Right, that's enough of that. What does the second character want from the protagonist? Closure, revenge, a hug example. I think the Queen wants a Wrap on an adjective that could describe an object. Sweary word. Three verbs, e.g., running, rampaging, loving. <laughs> Bombardment. Something slash somebody vulnerable. Singular. So, old lady, baby bird, toddler. Oh dear. <laughs> Choir boy. <laughs> The protagonist's favourite drink. Ooh, let's go for something spicy. Petrol. Three animals. Cotabus. Beaver. And American. Two body parts, plural, legs, arms, hair. Left buttock. Spleen. And finally, what's your pen name? Adam T. Ahog. Ha! Huh. Write me a story, generator! We think your plot might be naughty. Oh dear. If you want to be cheeky, go to Erotica Generator. That's the next video! And so, ladies and gentlemen, we have our short story. And I'm going to read it to you in a manner most gentlemanly. I shall read you the story called The Sweary Word, A Crusty Piece of Phlegm. And I think I've spelt phlegm wrong. This is a short story by Adam T. Ahog. Ned the Nissan had always loved a bit like Auschwitz's damlag chat box with its short, sour steezers. It was a place where he felt ambivalent. He was a bald, balding, petrol drinker <laughs> with, with blimp-esque left buttock and rotund spleen. <laughs> Sorry, I'm spitting everywhere. His friends saw him as a curious... Colourful crumpet. Once, that must be crumpet king, surely. Once he had even helped a super choir boy cross the road. <laughs> That's the sort of man he was. Nedded walked over to the window and reflected on his foamy surroundings. 
the bloody pissing it down, teased like bombarding cocktopus. <laughs> then he saw something in the distance, or rather someone. It was the figure of Queen Elizabeth II. Queen Elizabeth was a queer Rolf Harris with twazak left buttock and a slight and a slight bit gay spleen. <laughs> Ned had gulped. He was not prepared for Queen Elizabeth. As Ned had stepped outside and Queen Elizabeth came closer, he could see the thoughtful smile on his face. I forgot to select Queen Elizabeth being a woman. Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> oh, dear. I am here... I am here because I want a strap-on, Queen Elizabeth bellowed in a Jimmy Saffle tone. <laughs> he, he slammed his fist against Nedder's chest with the force of 9,190 American. <laughs> I frigging hate you, Nedder. I frigging hate you, Nedder the Nissan. Nedder looked back. Even more happy as Larry, and still fingering the sweary word, a crust piece of phlegm. Queen Elizabeth, nice britches, he replied. They looked at each other with discombobulated feelings, like two brainy, boiled beaver, raping at a very wonky some crap American holiday, which had a black a cappella music playing, which had black a cappella music playing in the background. And I'm going to start this sentence again. They looked at each other with discombobulated feelings, like two brainy, boiled beaver raping at a very wonky, some crappy American holiday, which had black a cappella music playing in the background and two long and girthy uncles pillaging to the beat. <laughs> oh. Ned had regarded Queen Elizabeth's twazic left buttock and a slight bit gay spleen. He held out his hand. Ned had a car, doesn't have a hand. Let's not fight, he whispered gently. Hmm, pondered Queen Elizabeth. Please, begged Ned Ed, with puppy dog eyes. Queen Elizabeth looked crappy, his body blushing like an alert, afraid, a long lost penis. <laughs> This reminds me of one of my, um, my reacts videos I did. Then Queen Elizabeth came inside for a nice drink of petrol. The end. I do hope you enjoyed my short story. Please go make your own. I'll leave a link to the site in the description below. And I think I'm either going to go for the movie script writer next generator or erotica generator. Tell me which one. Movie script or erotica generator. Please give your opinions down below. And if I get none, or like two, then I'll be having words again, because I don't like that. Also, your super self! Because why not? This has been A Heap of Games, Adam speaking. Tra toodle pip toodle -oo, and cheer! Me! Oh, bang! Sorry. See you later. <laughs>